struggles to help special needs children finds itself in a crisis of its own. The charity was targeted by thieves not once but twice in less than two weeks. Ivan News anchor Alona Carson shows us why the woman who runs the Special Cheers Ranch says those thieves stole something money cannot replace. If you drove by this piece of land along Clay Road, you'd probably never know. Special things go on inside those gates. This is a miracle blessing place for them. The Special Cheer Ranch uses horses, dogs, goats, and bunnies to help children with disabilities and developmental challenges. All right, let's go, Carlos. Carlos Perez has autism. He started coming to Special Cheer three years ago. He loves to come here. Since Carlos started to ride the horses at the ranch, his father has seen a dramatic change in his son. He's making a lot of progress here because the therapy with the horses is a lot of benefit for them. Because of all the good work that goes on here, the ranch operators and visitors wonder why thieves would break in twice and steal badly needed equipment. Violated our property, drugged our dogs, and broke into our barn and stole all of our western tack and bridles uh, and saddles. That's pretty sad. I mean, I don't know how can they do that because uh, this is a place for uh, disabled persons. Twice in the past two weeks, thieves broke into the ranch and stole thousands of dollars in landscaping equipment along with six western saddles and bridles used for the trail rides. Special cheer runs on donations. Now they'll have to find money to replace all their stolen property. Everything that they took from us will have to be you know, replaced as soon as we're able to afford to replace it. Ranch operators feel the thieves did something far worse than just steal material items. It hurts them to not understand why mankind is so cruel. This is 